Well, it's a wintry day here in Colorado here at the Poor Boy Ranch. We got Toby out running over there. We got Bear here, always by my side. Abby laying over there, enjoying the sun and shade, protecting her food dish. Our first snow is about all gone. About four inches here the other day, about three days ago. It's about 37 degrees out. Pretty nice here in the sun. It feels like 60, 65 in the sun. Uh, you don't even feel the cold, but the temperature out here is about 30, 37 degrees, somewhere in there, coming up to be. Go out here and let you all see how Rose and Dude are doing. And Rose looking back at us. Rose was abandoned by Al. And same with Bear. Bet they're going to new owners, huh, Rose? That's Rose right there. This is Dude, my good friend. But they're not going far, they're just going about a mile and a half away. Uh, I'll still be able to visit them see them from time to time but yeah they're getting new owners they're going to a new home oh dude Toby running in. Hi, Toby. But as you can see, it's a beautiful day here at the Poor Boy Ranch. Snow on the top of the mountains way back there. But on the south side of Blanca, there's no snow. I'm sure there is on the north side, but there's no snow on the south side. We're in December. But those peaks over there have got some onto them. A little hazy view. Pretty nice out here today. What do you think, dude? What do you think there, Rose, huh? She sure looks a lot better since she's been here with me the past couple months. She's going to a new home. She's going to start getting training and she's a two year old filly. And she's going to be the project of a 13 year old girl who's going to start learning herself how to train so they both get to learn together and dude is going to her sister so 
So they're both going to learn, they're all going into training. Dude's going to lose his fat belly. Yeah. Dude's going to lose his fat belly. He's going to have to start working for his feed. But they sure put a lot of good manure down so I can have a good garden. This whole area here is going to make nice garden space. Give me a nice organic layer down. There's no organic layer on this on this property out here. It's all sand and sediment. So all this manure is really going to help me hold the moisture in, and my garden is going to grow very well. Yeah. Oh, it's nice. Quiet. Hell, if I was in the city right now, you'd have a hard time hearing dudes chewing. Rose too. <laughs> Dead Toby. That little dog is the bravest little dog I've met. And it's funny how the horses pay attention to him too. It's really weird. Even Rose is unbroken tame as she is, you know. She even pays attention to Toby. Toby runs out there when they get excited and he barks at them to tell them to settle down. He doesn't like it when they're running around the, the pen. Both of them look at him like, you know, we could squash you in a heartbeat, but they back off of him and they, start, they settle down. They haven't squashed him yet. Huh, Rose? Huh, my baby girl? Yeah. I'm a baby girl. I sure do spoil you guys, don't I? Huh. I'm glad they're not going far away. I'm glad it's just only a mile or so over the ridge. I can go see him anytime I want. At least he'll be well taken care of. All they do here is eat and walk around the pen. I can't work them or anything like that, but they sure have produced what I wanted. All that manure. They did their job for me. I'm happy that they're going to somebody who's going to be able to work them and make them useful. Now it's probably time to get a cow. <laughs> Maybe not. Make sure are a good couple horses, good horses here. But that's about all, folks. Poor Boy Ranch is doing fine. Y'all have a good one. We'll talk to y'all soon.